Bonjour and welcome to my channel. I used to speak French, live in French and work in French, so I have a French accent. Sorry for that. I decided to make a series of English videos, so be patient with me and let's begin. <music> Let me introduce you to that project. I decided to build a rover. The rover that we can find in that movie, The Last Days on Mars. If you didn't see the movie, check it out. Only for the rover. The rover is absolutely insane. I love it. It's realistic. It feels real, even though it's not. But I like the way it's built, the, the way it moves on the surface of the planet. And for these reasons, I decided to build my own. Unfortunately, I didn't find a lot of images of that rover on the internet to base my work on. Except that one of my friends sent me this series of images on which I based all my design. So let me show you what I did and stick with me because this is going to be a long series of video of me designing, 3D printing, and building this specific rover until the end. So you're gonna see all the steps that I went through, all the tests that I did, and you'll see me construct, paint, and mount the parts for that vehicle. So let's begin. The first thing I did is I cut the images in separate parts. We can see here the side view, the front view, and the back view and the top view. All these images were loaded in Fusion 360. The first part I decided to draw is the body. As you can see here, we, got a, we have a rough design of the body that I made. And then I designed one of the wheels. This is actually the version 2 of the wheel because the first try was a failure when I decided to print it. As you can see here, we have the, all the details, the structure inside the wheel so I can print it without support. And for the rest, I'm, I intend to use a long screw to go through the wheel to the structure of the suspension under the vehicle. If I move the body around, you can see that the image matches the design. It matches the wheel with the back view and the top view. Everything seems to be correct. Now let's hide the body and zoom on the wheel. As you can see here, I even prepare all the joints so I can test the wheel. As you see here, I can test the suspension. Everything seems to be correctly moving. I can turn the wheel, like the servo motors will turn the wheels once installed on the body and I can even spin the wheel let me show you I'm gonna double click on the joint to spin the wheel and you see this the wheel spinning yeah so this is about it for the first part now Stick with me because this series will contain a lot of videos and the goal is to show you all the steps I made to design, print and create the body for that rover. So this is it for today. Thank you for staying with me until the end. Please share, give me a thumbs up and check on my YouTube channel because you're going to see a next video in about a week. Thank you and bye.